Hi, I'm Bill Ritchie in Seattle, Washington, and I'm going to demonstrate how to use the Wee Woody Rembrandt Press that's going to be displayed at the International Woodworkers Fair in Atlanta this year. For this demonstration, Rick Miller and I created the uh, printing plate that has the CNC Shark logo, the machine that helped make this press. Before I started the demo, I dampened some pieces of uh, lightweight Japanese paper. It's called Hosho. It's a student grade paper. And I put it in a plastic bag, put a book on top of it to keep it flat. On my printing, on my work surface, I put a vinyl uh, cloth out to keep the press uh, sitting still, give it a little grip when I'm working on it. We provide several kinds of uh, felt to give it some uh, pressure to give it some embossing power and depending on how thick the plate is and how high the roller is uh, we use two or three of these felts. On top of them we put a piece of vinyl. The vinyl also gives it some gripping power. I test it for the pressure. Seems to be about right. I like to fold those felts back out of my way. Now I'm ready to ink my plate. I have a glass slab. I roll out some ink. This is a speedball water-based ink. Makes cleanup very easy. The same company, Speedball, makes a hard rubber roller I'm using here. You have to roll that ink out in two directions all the time to keep it nice and flat. You have to ink and re-ink and re-ink until it's all evenly coated. Drop the plate into the recessed area on the press bed. Take out a piece of the dampened Hosho paper. And on top of that, I put a little piece of heavier paper in case the ink comes through the paper and uh, gets on my felts. Also helps keep it from embossing too deeply. The press is copied after the famous replica of the Rembrandt press that's about six feet tall. If you're in Amsterdam you can see it at the Rembrandt Hus Museum. Once through and back out again. And there's my print. Well, that's all for this press, the Stretch Wee Woody, the fancy one going to the uh, show in Atlanta. And I thought it would be interesting now to uh, switch presses and switch over to the uh, other model we have, the more like a toy model of the Wee Woody Rembrandt Press, which is a bit more affordable. It's available online. It's also made by the CNC Shark System by Rick Miller. And uh, everything works the same, but I thought it would be fun to pull a proof and prove it. I'm using the same block. These blocks, are, by the way, are cut from polyvinyl chloride, the same stuff that uh, plumbing pipe is made of. The do-it-yourself Wee Woody Rembrandt press comes with the felts as well and the vinyl blanket. Everything works the same. This one is put together with 18 screws whereas the original collector model is put together entirely with wooden pegs. Rick and I made several models of the Wee Woody Rembrandt Press before we were happy and then we won the silver award at the A Design and Competition in Milan, Italy in 2014.
I like to think of it as part of a game printing woodcuts based on Rembrandt. So that's it for this demonstration. Thanks for watching. I'm Bill Ritchie.